Okay, hello and welcome to this uh, PHP tutorial series. What we're going to be looking at in this series is how to create a very simple, very simple, in fact you can see from the page here, um, Minecraft server list. Um, and the most important point is that all of the information that is going to be displayed on the uh, view server page, which I'll show you in a moment, is taken directly from the server. It's not, um, a, there's no sort of third party plugin or server mod required or anything like that. Um, yeah, and also it doesn't require any specific server configuration. So you can sort of do this query to pretty much any server ever, and it should work for at least quite a while. So let's get on with the demonstration. So as you can see here, we've got these four servers, the top one being my public server, and the bottom three just being three of the ones that I could think of off the top of my head. So if we just click on the top server, you can see that it is online, the MOTD, um, I'll show you what that is in a moment, just in case you don't know, is, well, that, and the number of slots is 6 out of 100. So that means there are 6 people online and there are 100 slots available. Um, so the only sort of major disadvantage of using this method over the previous method that I showed you, which was using MineQuery, the plugin, is that you can't get the actual names of the players that are online. However, the sort of added simplicity of not needing a plugin and just knowing that it will work on whatever port the server is running on and sort of, you know, well, the simplicity, um, I think, sort of outweighs that. And also, the list of players online isn't really that useful to someone just browsing, is it? So, yeah. Anyway, let's just have a look at one of the other examples, just to show that it is actually different. So let's try Reddit Creative. Notice it takes quite a while longer to load. Um, anyway, see that they have their MOTD as that, and they've got 40 players out of a possible 150 online. So if I just go across to the Minecraft game, the actual client, and click on multiplayer, this is where this information is coming from. What this script is actually doing is sending the exact same query as the um, game does when it gets the information for this page. So you can see that the MOTD is this bit of text here, the number of players is 6 out of 100 obviously, and the ping, 201 milliseconds, is just related to the um, amount of time that the server takes to reply. Um, and We could actually measure that, um, but I don't think we'll do that in this tutorial because it's not that useful. Anyway, that's enough of demonstration, so in the next part, none of this website will work, and we will get on with sort of coding it so that it does work. Okay, so thank you for watching, and come back for part one if this looks like something you'd like to know how to do.